Hi guys, my name's Sabrina, welcome back to the channel. So, last week I didn't upload a video because I was in Illinois visiting family. So, this video is a vlog all about that. And, ironically, the one time I need to do a voiceover for like almost my entire video is the one time I'm like really sick. So that's fun. I know I sound disgusting, but we're all just gonna have to deal with it. Yay! Okay, on to the video. Hope you enjoy. Hey, what's up, you guys? Yes! <laughs> Hi. Um, so I'm in Illinois. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't have a video planned. Uh, I was gonna try to vlog, but I forgot, and it's already the second day. It's the 4th of July. <laughs> yeah, happy 4th! Happy birthday, Marco! Um, so we went to a parade. That was fun. Saw a camel. Here are some clips. Oh, so Hello! Oh my goodness! Uh, hello! Okay. Um, Hope you enjoyed the <laughs> Enjoy the rest of the video. <laughs> So Ariel and I had woken up at 7 a.m. that morning to go to the parade, and then our cousins didn't come until later that day, so we took a big old nap. And then once our cousins came, we played a game of baseball at the park. Uh, my team lost, and Ariel and Anthony won. Um, in the next clip, Ariel's trying to make a temporary tattoo, and just the look on Anthony's face is always so fucking funny. So I am doing the like temporary tattoo thing. <laughs> so the first thing I'm gonna do is spray it with bad bits. Okay. <laughs> Ew, why are you spraying? <laughs> oh my god, I'm falling! <laughs> it doesn't work! Now, I need to soak it in hot water. Okay, have fun! Bye! At this point of the night, Anthony had to leave and Ariel revealed her beautiful tattoo of nothingness. Um, she got so disappointed, she almost just started drawing in Sharpie all over her arm, and it was great. You can see the disappointment on her face. The next morning, we made smoothies, and Ariel- this is just Ariel looking at expired yogurt. <laughs> and we watched, uh, Stranger Things while we were waiting for my mom to drive us to the thrift store. But to our surprise, the thrift store was closed! <laughs> we were gonna go thrift shopping. But it closed at 5, and it's like, it just turned 5. 5.05. Now we're walking to the mall. I don't even get why. It's like the day after July 4th, but it's, that's and like it's a not a holiday. Yeah, it's a Friday. Whatever. Last time, like in December when I came, we went at night. Yeah. Didn't we? Yeah. yeah we, it closed, that day it closed at night. <laughs> the first day you came with me. I don't know. Okay, well, we're going to the mall. <laughs> so, we'll walk there. So, fun story. I forgot to vlog while we were at the mall, but this is us at 2 p.m. the next day at the thrift store we wanted to go to. Um, Ariel and I were debating whether seeing pockets out of shorts were trendy or not, and I don't think so, but she does. She tried them on and didn't end up getting it, though. And I also saw this really cool shirt for 99 cents. It was so hard to resist. Um, Ariel and I separated for a while, and... She just ended up getting too many things and ended up needing a cart. So she found me in the aisle I was in and just dumped all of her clothes onto the floor next to me while she ran to go get one. And I was just anxiety ridden while waiting for her to come back and hoping that a worker wouldn't come by and start yelling at me for making a mess. Um, also, Ariel had to go somewhere later that day and she didn't think I could solve this Rubik's Cube, but I fucking did it before she got back. Hell yeah. Okay, did I solve it? Did I solve it? Did I solve it? Ah! Oh, I did! I would have perfected! Oh my god! Da! You did it! How long I did, did you? Like 30 minutes. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Anthony came over and we watched It Follows, which was a terrible movie. I don't know why it got such high reviews. But anyways, we were going to Chicago the next morning. Um, and this was my fit and it's so cute. The pants kind of gave me a long vagina and it made my ass look flabby, but it's okay because I looked hot. Um, but my grandma would say that I'm showing too much skin. So I had to cover up before we left the house. <laughs> I'd be looking like a trash, trash. Let go. Give me your heart. Give me your song. Sing it with all your might. Come to the fountain. And you can be satisfied. Come to the fountain. And let me hear you say. 
specified. Steve calls the. Steve, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> You're so loud. After we got off the subway, we walked all the way to Millennium Park. It wasn't that far, it was like a few blocks, so it wasn't that bad. Um, but when we got there, we saw the bean and this cute little seagull on top who shitted on the bean. Love that. I also tried to eat the bean, but I really couldn't fit it around my mouth. So maybe when I come back again next year, I'll try again. Um, and then we walked all the way to Buckingham Fountain. It was a few blocks more. It wasn't really hot this day. It was like only hot in the sun. Uh, and then my family stopped at this, like, tourist boutique thing to get some sunglasses, and Ariel got these cute ones, and Anthony and I, being the cool dudes with- who already had sunglasses, were just standing by. This is me and Ariel being dumbasses, cause I need b-roll. Segway gang! Segway gang! Segway! <laughs> this is so shitty! <laughs> it's really ugly! No, I like it. I think it's pretty. My hair is so fucked up. Look at the wind like fucked up my my little hashtag windy city. <laughs> we were on the subway or something and she was like, oh my god, it's so windy. I forgot we're in the windy city. That's it's funny. Shut up. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go back to our family. Bye. From the Buckingham Fountain, we walked all the way the heck to Navy Pier. It was a long ass walk, but we saw some dogs. We saw some geese. It was along like Michigan. It was kind of cute. Um, we were going to go on the architecture boat tour, which Anthony and I had already been on in like middle school, but I guess they build new buildings or whatever. So like some of it is new. <laughs> Life. Jesus. I'm high on life. High on, high on life. I'm high, high on, on Jesus. life. Wow. Jesus. Wow. Jesus. Ariel asked for the ox um, to play Jesus music. They said no. Hi, Jesus. Can we do some karaoke? No, why? Jesus, 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 no. Jesus. So the boat tour was pretty fun. We saw these cute little people on the bridge. I tried to wave to as many people as I possibly could along the streets and on bridges. Um, and then I saw the Trump Tower and I just gave it a little, a little middle finger just for Trump so he could feel my hatred. But then I saw Pride Flag and it was great. I love Pride Flags. We love the LGBT community. Love that. Um, being on a boat was pretty fun. Ariel, Anthony, and I kind of got sleepy towards the end. Um, we just really needed coffee. And here's the Sears Tower if anyone wanted to see it. I mean, like, I guess it's really tall. You want Starbucks? What? Do you want Starbucks? I want Starbucks. Coffee? What in Chicago? <laughs> After the boat tour, we were all pretty drowsy, so we got into the nearest Starbucks we could find. Here's the motherfucking tea. I downed my drink in five minutes because I was so tired, and my bladder protested later in the day. But we had one more place to go, and that was the Hancock Building, which is like the fifth tallest building in the in Chicago, not in the world, Jesus Christ. But um, it was so high up that my ears popped. We love that. And we got tickets to go on this thing where the windows tilt forward and uh, your body freaks out because it thinks it's gonna die. And I really thought I was gonna fall. <laughs> oh no! Oh, I didn't know oh it tilted God, down that I'm far. So I'm so scared! <laughs> that does not look safe. Oh my heart is <laughs> Because of safety issues, I wasn't allowed to record my experience, but this is what it felt like. Not exactly because I had a huge adrenaline rush and it's just way different when you're in person. Anthony was straight up shaking for like five minutes. I'm shaking. <laughs> then it was time to take the train back home. And this ride was really loud and bumpy for some reason. It was pretty scary. And we saw a heroin needle and a lighter on the floor next to us. We love a true Chicago City experience. I also saw a cat outside in my grandma's house, and he was beautiful. I wanted to pet him, but he wouldn't let me. And now, an aerial performance. Please enjoy. She put so much passion into this work. Stop, Ariel, no! <laughs> I hate you. I hate you. <laughs> You're not even doing the dance right. Ew, oh my god. Stop! <laughs> what? Stop! Oh my god, you 
your butt is out. <laughs> Are you done? <laughs> so on this day, we were supposed to visit my hometown, Huntley, Illinois, so we could spend time with family and go to Dairy Mart so I could get a blueberry smoothie. But our car broke down, the brake line started leaking, so we went into Johnny's place while we waited for a tow truck and they had amazing food and great quarter machines. We got so many fun things from their quarter machines. Hello, everybody. <laughs> I got my teeth done today. Oh, they're so beautiful. It smells so good. Ew. I hope we get a squeegee ball. What is it? What is it? I think it's a tattoo. Yeah, it's a tattoo. I want a tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> my aunt picked us up and we went to Woodfield Mall for some shopping. I didn't really vlog at all because I was shopping, but we were there for a few hours. Um, Ariel couldn't sleep over with me that night, which made me really sad, but she was able to come with me to my uncle's house all the way up in Waukegan, Illinois. They had a cute little puppy named Coconut. I'm low-key allergic to dogs though, so she gave me a sore throat and itchy eyes, which was great. But my uncle's house was like 20 minutes away from Wisconsin. So we went to a beach up in Wisconsin. There was a thong on the sign. We loved that. Um, it was pretty cute. This is Lake Michigan. She, it was, she was pretty clean. There was like barely any people. Um, I tried skipping stones because there were a lot of rocks. But I'm so bad at it. That's me skipping a stone. But plop, loop, wouldn't go. This is Ariel trying to skip stones. I mean, not really, she just kind of threw it in there, but we kind of just gave up and sh we just ended up throwing some rocks into the ocean. I mean, sea, lake, it's a lake, I'm smart. Um, and then we picked up some trash before we left because you nasties, you shouldn't leave your trash on the beach. Someone left their whole ass McDonald's cup and a beer can. But anyways, since it was my last night um, in Illinois, we decided to pull an all-nighter and it went horribly. Ariel fell asleep at like five, 30 while we were trying to watch A Star is Born and I fell asleep like 30 minutes after making fun of her for falling asleep and finishing the movie. But we were hyped on caffeine for like a good two hours. So we watched The Notebook and Ariel was distraught by the ending. I wanted to be sad at the end of the notebook, but Ariel's crying was so funny to me. Anyways, I had a flight the next day back to Vegas, so Ariel and I said our tearful goodbyes and said, see you next year. The flight, however, had so much turbulence and the pilot was so bad at landing the freaking plane. Look, we're about to pass over my college. Hey, UNLV. But Spirit Airlines, love ya. You, you have comfier seats than Frontier, but your pilots, make my ass fall out of my body anyways guys thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed um don't forget to subscribe like and comment i'm sorry if my voice is annoying and whatever i'll see you in the next video bye